Okay, so this is uh, the car that Jeffrey Earnhardt drove in Michigan. The one that caught fire in such a spectacular fashion. And uh, sitting here evaluating the situation and that spring screw is bent. Okay, that's one inch hardened steel, and it's bent, and then that whole frame horn is gone, and there's even a sway bar still in it, and the sway bar, there you go, alright, it'll come out, better get that before somebody else does. The rest of the car don't look that bad until you look inside, okay? And here again, it don't look all that bad until you look at the floor over there, okay? There's a deep bubble. All right, that sheet metal was flat, and now it's got a buckle, which means all the ch chassis members and stuff are gone, okay? And then look at this uh, package tray here. See all the buckling? All the buckling there? This whole chassis is done. Even though the outer envelope really don't look that bad from this angle. Okay, but then you get over here and here's some more buckling. Okay, so apparently the whole right side of this car has moved. Let's see if we can see that in the tube somewhere, maybe. Um, looking around, looking around, looking for usually a tube will accordion. Melted this plastic crap right here. The floor is even buckled under a seat. Although uh, that could have been from putting the seat in. But yeah, this car is toast. Get that bar and get it inside the shop. <laughs> 